Hey everyone, today we're diving into something a bit unsettling but crucial for your health. Tapeworms. Yes, those flat, ribbon-like creatures that can call your intestines home. It's not the most pleasant topic, but knowing how to protect yourself from these parasites is essential. Let's get started. So, what exactly are tapeworms? Well, they're parasitic worms that can grow up to several meters long right inside your body. They usually enter your system through contaminated food, mostly undercooked meat. Imagine eating a steak only to find out it served as a free ride for tapeworms into your body. Not the extra seasoning you'd want, right? But how do tapeworms affect you? Once inside, they can latch onto your intestines, absorbing nutrients that you eat. Sometimes they cause no symptoms and you might not even know they're there. But in severe cases, they can lead to nutritional deficiencies and even more serious complications if they travel to organs like your liver or lungs. All right, let's talk survival tactics. First up, heat. Cooking your meat properly is your first line of defense. Make sure those steaks are heated to at least 62.7 degrees Celsius and ground meats to at least 71.1 degrees Celsius. This ensures any lurking parasites are cooked away. Next, consider your meat storage. Freezing meat at minus 20 degrees Celsius for a day can kill off any resilient tapeworm eggs. It's a simple yet effective way to safeguard your health. When you're traveling, especially in regions where tapeworm is more common, like some parts of Asia, Africa or Latin America, be extra cautious. Stick to well-cooked meals and bottled or boiled water. Remember, it's better to be safe than sorry when exploring new cuisines abroad. Don't forget about hygiene. Washing your hands might seem like basic advice, but it's a powerhouse move against parasites. Before cooking, eating, or after using the restroom, make hand washing a non-negotiable part of your routine. Lastly, watch your weight and appetite. If you find yourself unusually hungry all the time, it might not just be because you skipped breakfast, it could be a tapeworm. Keeping an eye on these signs can help you catch an infection early. So there you have it, your survival guide against tapeworms. It might seem a bit daunting, but with these steps, you can keep yourself safe and healthy. Stay vigilant and take care of your body. It's the only one you've got. Remember, knowledge is your best defense. Keep learning, keep watching, and as always, stay curious. Catch you in the next video.